Hi, this is Kim Bradley with Magnet Forensics. Today we'll be learning how to process vehicle data by using an exported extraction from Burla's IV software. First, to get the extraction, you'll need to export using IV. You can do this by going to Tools, Export, and Magnet. This will generate an export with an IVO extension. Now we're ready to bring the exported file into Axiom. With Axiom process already open, we'll go to our evidence sources. We'll select Vehicle, IV, Files and Folders, and then we're going to browse to the file that we need. I'll select the IVO file that was exported using IV software. You can rename the evidence if you would like, and go to Processing Details. We'll skip on down to the vehicle artifacts and you'll see that we have the location and travel category that has been selected for us. Go to analyze evidence and then we'll come back and take a look at our process case. Within the Axiom process case, let's take a look at the artifacts. Within communication, you see call logs and contacts. It's important to note that these categories may include data that was downloaded from a mobile device connected to the vehicle. Depending on what is allowed at the time of connectivity, phone data may be saved. This will vary depending on the type of phone and vehicle. These categories may also include calls initiated using the vehicle's console or interface. Other categories include media that contains files and the exported extraction. After selecting an individual artifact, the examiner can always use source linking to navigate to the selected file within the File System Explorer or use information in the Details pane for further analysis. Metadata will contain details extracted from the export related to the original acquisition of data from the vehicle or the vehicle itself. Attached devices will help examiners know of other potential evidence items. In Location and Travel, there are track points for logged entries of location coordinates, velocity points for the velocity of the vehicle at particular dates and times, and also waypoints for street addresses the user has entered on the vehicle. For a visual depiction of location data, you can always use the world map view. Thanks for watching.